let's back up one step probably before we prepare the bins begin more with possibly preparing a combine. We do some practices with the combines where they are pressure washed, cleaned out, and kept dry in a shed. Uh, I have seen some other farmers in years way back that would leave the grain in a hopper or not wash the combine and insects would actually get into the grain that was in a combine going from one crop to the next. And when they went up out of the truck to dump, the infected grain would go into the new crop and then from there into the bin, and that just began problems. So I think it actually needs to start with the combine, with the washing, the cleaning, monitoring the grain coming out of the field. So you may need to treat it as it's going into the bin, uh, which is a good practice. And then when they go back to the cleaning of the bin, when you clean out the previous crop, naturally as the sweep auger is going around, do your do your good housekeeping, sweep the side walls down. Uh, a leaf blower is real nice to blow the walls, sweep everything, every kernel out of the floor. And then after that is done, everything's good and clean. Usually within two weeks, we will try to get the bin sprayed. We're using Tempo with this time on the empty bins. That seemed to be one of the better registered products for doing that. And then once we spray, if the bin is empty for three or four months, we will try to get that bin sprayed maybe two more times before another crop goes back into it. Naturally, if we're a month before harvest, you know, we might not get it sprayed but one time.